Hello Capricorn, this is the weekly reading for Sun, Moon and Rising in Capricorn for the week of April 5th to April 12th. So Capricorns, we have a stellium of planets in Aries, right, with the Aries season starting in April. Now Mercury has joined the party here and Aries is your fourth house, right? It's all about home, property, your emotions. I'm, I'm, I'm getting more about where do you feel at home? Ask yourself this question, Capricorn. Where do you feel at home? Is it is your home, your house? Or you feel at home with some a person? Or this could be your spouse, this could be with children, this could be with your work. Where do you feel at home? And there could be a lot of communications and uh, regarding property issues. If you are trying to sell a home, buy a home. It could be also about, not marriage, but kind of family, you know, family. What's your family? Where's your family? Who's your family? And getting in touch with your inner child issues, with your family traditions, and especially with uh, your ancestors. What's your, uh, what's your legacy? What type of legacy do you want to leave to the world? And who's your family too, okay? So let's see what's Capricorn. I'm using the Nanormal for the overall energy, the Gilded for the main spread, and if needed, I'll clarify with the everyday tarot. Capis for the week of April 5 to April 12th. Capricorns. We have the mice here and you've got two cards here, okay? I don't read reversals in Lenormand not ever, okay? So this is the uh, fiery woman and the ten of wands, okay? <laughs> Five, four, 15, which is a six card and 11, 11 mirroring. So are you carrying some kind of a guilt here, Capricorn? Guilt, responsibilities, more I'm getting guilt here. With the test here, something is haunting you. Something is gnawing at your heart here, okay? Seven of Wands, okay? Someone or something is trying to keep you in a very protected energy, okay? This could be some kind of protection. And uh, someone is trying to steal your time, energy, your uh, energy, energy. Oh my goodness, I got energy vampire here. Are you dealing with the energy vampire here, Capricorn? Number five could also be change here. You're trying to get rid of someone that's trying to put a lot of burden on you. Trying Because Capricorns is always responsibility, right? You try to be responsible. You try to protect your kids, protect your family, protect your people, your loved ones, right? And someone is misusing it. That's what I'm getting here. So let's find out, Capis. I have the two of wands for you. Who had two of wands? Scorpio had. Okay. Death. <laughs> what did I say? Scorpio had and you got the Scorpio card. Sometimes, you know. Five of wands and the six of pentacles. Yes. Yeah, Capricorn. People are trying to to get your attention, fighting for your uh, time, fighting for, but you're putting an end to it and you're trying to choose a different path here, okay? Five of Wands is a mess, right? Trying to one-up someone, trying to argue in battles. You could have a people of, uh, a lot of people that are trying to snatch away your energy, 
मे बी मिस गाइडिंग यू गिविंग यू रॉन्ग एडवाइस टेलिंग यू टू स्टे स्टाक इन अ सिचुएशन and but you are ending it but you are ending it ending is a death is a big transformation okay i'm getting it you're trying to get rid of people that were trying to steal your energy for a long time they could be i'm getting see this is the pest pest we got the pest right so that they were a lot of pest not one pest a lot of pests in your life okay okay and you're trying to choose a different pathway right now good very good energy capricorn Ten of Cups, Five of Swords, Six of Wands, Nine of Cups, Ten of Swords, Moon Card, Seven of Pentacles, Knight of Cups, Page of Swords. Capricorn beware of Scorpio and Libra okay Libra because i got this energy for Libra okay i don't know if yeah Libra right 10 of cups 10 of swords 5 of swords page of swords okay Capricorn the first word i'm hearing is arrogance someone is arrogant here okay they think that they can hurt you and get away with it or they think that you have lost something and they have gained something there's a smug energy here with the six of wands moon page of swords ten of swords and the nine of cups okay ten of cups here maybe Capricorn, keep your ideas to yourself. Keep your next move hidden. And if you are having a lot of people that's trying to influence you, that's what I'm getting influenced. If they're trying to influence you by raising, gassing you up, you know, gassing you up, saying that, oh man, you don't have to do that. You are, uh, you are this, you are that. You can, you don't have to go do that. You don't have to do this. try to stay away from people that is trying to boost your ego your arrogance here with false intentions and also be aware of social media gossip social media stalking i don't like the moon and the page of swords together okay page of swords is secret and the moon is also secret with the six of wands someone's reputation is at yeah someone's reputation is being spoiled here with the gossip or some kind of hidden information here and also mercury in your fourth house definitely mercury with a bit being so active with uh, aries here be aware of communications that are gossip here clarify the six of wands what's this uh victory or reputation chariot and rovers okay clarify the moon the knight of cups and rivers the page of swords five of pentacles okay capricorn very simple okay someone is jealous of your jealous of you jealous of your accomplishments jealous of you moving on to someone else moving away to a new job a new career a new place or getting your 10 of cups your family life or your wish fulfillment okay someone is absolutely jealous and they are not taking your rejection or 
they are, if you are trying to leave a gang of friends, a gang or a ex partner here, or a ex lover here, okay, they are absolutely spying on you, stalking you, trying to, trying to win you back again. I don't think it's worth it, okay? Because the intentions are not good here. With the Five of Swords and the Ten of Swords and the Knight of Cups, this is a player, absolute player, okay, who would love to seduce you and use you for your money, your wealth. I'm, I'm getting this energy vampire, right? I got this energy vampire. This is the energy vampire here. The Page of Swords and the Five of Pentacles, they are not ready to accept that you are moving away from them, okay? But you should, okay? Moving on is the best revenge, okay? Moving on is the best revenge. Choose a good pathway and the depth here to the major arcana, endings of new beginnings, okay? So, if you're transforming yourself into uh, uh, and making yourself into a, I think you're raising up in your life. That's what I'm getting. You're raising up in your life and people are jealous. So, take care of your energy this week, uh, Capricorn. Thank you.